Well, hello again, guys, and thank you for checking out another one of our videos here at Black Stag Styling. Um, I say checking out another one. Of course, if you haven't checked out any before, please do get on the channel. Loads of interesting and cool stuff we get involved in from the vans and pickups, motorbikes, cars, styling, uh, hydro dipping, loads of bits. So get on the channel, check out some of the other videos. But the reason you're joining us for today um, and for the rest of this week is we are working with another another VW uh, Transporter T6. Um, quite a few bits and pieces we're doing to this one. Um, so lots and lots of styling um, we are doing. So we've got, uh, starting at the front of the vehicle, we are taking the front bumper off. We've got new gloss black grills to go in. That's top and bottom. Uh, so they'll change the look of the front we're doing the main VW badge the badge itself is going in orange uh, same as the rear badge and then the back sections are staying in the gloss black we've then got a lower section uh, like a, a, a splitter so an add-on splitter turns it into the sport line style uh, front bumper so that'll be test fitted uh, painted in body color uh, and then of course fitted and bonded onto the vehicle with the gloss black grills of course as well uh, so that made a big difference to the front moving to the sides of the vehicle we have some new uh, alloy wheels really smart 18 inch alloy wheels in like a metallic black um, and then we are also doing the brake calipers so brake calipers will be fully prepped done in heat resistant orange paint uh, of course going with the front and rear badges uh, then moving to the back of the vehicle we are are doing the roof spoilers so they'll add that sporty finish um, uh, they're going in body color be bonded onto the vehicle we're removing some of the other badges the chrome badges and polishing the areas up and like I say we've got the back badge going in the main VW section in orange to match the calipers in the front and then the back section in the black so uh, yeah quite a few bits and pieces we're doing to this it's uh, gonna look really cool we love working with the VW so stay tuned for this one big thanks to uh, Will and his wife for trusting us uh, to style this they've been following us on our social media so do check us out on Facebook and Instagram uh, of course watching the videos on YouTube uh, like and subscribe to the old channel and then you can stay fully up to date with everything we're doing but we will um, get this vehicle into the workshop and start doing the work so run the intros we'll catch you in a moment here we go <laughs> Right, here we go. We've got the uh, T6 in. The guys are just test fitting the front bumper sections, aren't you, Tommy? Morning. How you doing? Very well, nice sir. Close up with my <laughs> old face. Yeah, all seems to be. There we go. It. It's fitting the lovely, yeah, isn't it? You got any screws in yet, look? That's on there solid, look. It's fitting a treat, isn't it? Yeah. Pleased with that, Ed? I'm pleased with it, mate. Got the little bottom section as well. Yeah, that's going on underneath afterwards. And that'll fit okay. on there nicely. Split a section. Superb. So just be a case of. Uh, Popping it off, getting it prepped, getting it painted. Hey, what, Alan? It's not bad for a boomerang. We've got a family, isn't it? It's a big boomerang, isn't it? For trying. Lovely. Right, so as you can see, we've now got the bumper off. Tommy has already been stripping the grill sections out and fitting the new ones. I'm just about to see them in there. Hello. He's got his, hello there, pal. Got right. his new front grill yep. in the gloss black. Just to start lining that up and getting that all fitted on there. Lovely job. Don't fit too bad, do they, Tommy? No, not three bad. Three bad to two bad. See what we're doing. There we go, it's getting it lined up nicely. But... It's this pressure on this camera. <laughs> There's all the bits off that. There's the old grill sections from the lower grill. A couple more of them over here. There we go. And like I say, it's now getting the new grill in. Yeah. Put that camera down and give us a hand, would you? <laughs> <laughs> Look at that. Here we go, get the bumper back on already. With the new grill sections all in it. Looking lovely. I'll then just leave us the lower section to get on once it's all painted and the grills are all fitted. Right, so we have, or Tommy has now, removed the badges off the back. So we've got the VW badge off there, also where the transport badges were. 
So here they're all gone, and then Tommy's got over here, he's got the badges, the VW badges. Here he is. Yeah. Just prepping them ready for a bit of paint, haven't we? Well, I've finished, but yeah. Oh, well, that Just do. finished, this second. But do yeah, tell we... us, do tell us, young man, what do you do to get them ready for paint? So, we'll get ourselves a little bit of 320 and a little mini DA, like so, to dull it over. It's quite yeah. simple, and then you get a bit of 320 on a soft pad, a little gold pad, and, uh, yeah. to get in all the little nooks and crannies. Nice. So, um, that's all ready for wet on wet. It's 320, it's quite harsh, so you need some uh, primer over the top. Tell us what the wet and wet is, mate. So the wet and wet is basically you you get your primer, you prime it, and then you just go straight over with your colour. Whereas if you were like this primer here, high build primer, you let that go off, you rub it down, and then you paint it. So wet and wet is just like an extra barrier between to help the adhesion on these chromes because they're notoriously very yeah. shiny. Sure. Stays on there nicely. So, yeah. Yeah. Lovely job, thank you pal. Hope that explains it for you. It's so like story time with Tommy. Thank you. And we have another one that Tommy's doing just here, look. He brought me nicely onto that one. So this is him for a lot of body work, isn't it mate? Yeah, yeah, this has had a lot, a lot. That was uh, stoved in down the whole side. It was, so, wasn't it? Um, so we've got new, two new doors for this one. Yeah. And then Tommy's done the repairs. That's another VWT6, because we do all the body work here as well. So, um, yeah, there you go, look. All the action, where all the action is, isn't it, mate? Yeah. Oh, yeah, Come baby. Woohoo! <laughs> right, so now about to get the wheels, the new wheels on. Uh, but we just thought I'd also show the calipers that Rob's done in the orange. Looking, looking nice and smart. This is to go with the centres of the badges as well. Uh, clips done in the blacks, so they've been cleaned up, done in the heat resistant paint. So Rob's now going to get the wheels on. We've got the um, spaces, of course, to go on as well. Nearly so we, forgot. He nearly forgot. <laughs> so we're getting them on as well. Nice wheels, these. Oh, so BBS. Really smart. Spaces, I think we've got 15 mil, I think it was, spaces now going on. So Rob will line this all up. So we've also put the copper slip on the backs as well just onto the hubs, just so nothing sticks onto it. So they're, uh, they'll all come off in the future if need be for servicing. Yeah. Like so Rob, nice guys. That's right, real nice guys. Nice guys. Uh, Rob's just doing them finger tight to begin with, and then we we'll use our, uh, our uh, little impact driver just to tighten them up a little bit. And then of course, torque wrench, just to finish it all. So because of the type of wheel being a black wheel, we've also got black lockers and black bolts, of course, as well. Longer bolts, in case anyone's thinking, well, they're putting spacers on. So we've got longer bolts to go with the spacers, so we don't cause any problems with what we're fitting. Rob's even taking the stickers off. Yeah, but there so you, you don't go. slip on the ice, you know. <laughs> Right, so Fraser has just finished painting and lacquering the lower front bumper section. So I just thought I'd give you a little look at this. It's got obviously all the gr uh, black grill sections all fitted, but it is all now painted and lacquered, ready to be fitted and bonded onto the van. So we'll get on with that and uh, give you a shout in a moment, let you see uh, as we get the bits onto the van. Right, we're just going to see Fraser, who is, has got the uh, rear spoilers all fitted onto the van, uh, bonded on. He's just now doing a little bit of polishing, so we'll see how he's getting Here on. Here he is, look. Hey. Hi. <laughs> Ed's just getting the front bumper all ready to get the uh, front section all on. Just getting everything all prepped up in your pal. Yeah mate, you know it. 
Wheels are now on, calipers done. Wheels are, uh, wheels are smart. And uh, with the orange calipers looking good. We've got our spacers on there as well. Just to bring the wheels out that little bit. We've got the badges and everything left to go back on in a moment. Right, here we go, the guys are on it. Getting the new front section onto the lovely VW Transporter. They were supposed to wait for me, but you know... We I waited long enough for you. <laughs> get up, get up Don't be like there, that. <laughs> they were so on it, they're already on it. Don't you, buff? Yeah, buff. So here we go, look. Getting it all on there, looking lovely. Just like Fraser. Lining it all up, bolting it in place, bit of sealing and bonding to be done at the end as well. We have got our lower spoiler section as well that will go on this. That's just sitting here. So that's got to be fitted at the end. We've got a few bits. Look, there we go. So our uh, transport, it's having some bodywork. I think we've already showed you that. Another vehicle here as well for some bodywork. Guys right, are on so it. We're now getting the lower section, the uh, little lip spoiler that goes in the additional bumper extension. Just getting that all fitted. Razor's just screwing it in as we speak. Make sure it's all lined. We've just test fitted it and lined it all up. And let's mark this just as a, an additional extra bit on the bottom. Can't beat an additional bit on the bottom, can you? Ah, additional bit on the bottom. Love it. <laughs> Right now, time to get the orange front badge on. Here we go. There you go. Lovely jubbly. What are we doing, Francois? Here we go. So we're going back on with the badge. We're just cleaning it up with a bit of solvent degreaser and then time for the new oh what have we got there for old bit of the this uh, is some, uh, some primer this is for the old tape to stick on lovely. this is not a lollipop don't eat them because they do not taste nice as you know mm, a bit <laughs> sticky a bit bitty bitty <laughs> There we go, and then we'll leave that for a minute, and then we'll stick the badge on. Lovely. Right, so we've got our double-sided tape, and we frazoir on the back of the badge. Yep. So we're now going to go on with the old badge. Yeah, that he's using his. Special glass eye to make sure it's straight. Yep, that's on there, yeah. straight. <laughs> <laughs> that's good, Alan. What do you reckon, straight? Oh, lovely job, look. Right, look. Da, da, da. right, now time to give the van a wash. Just before before we do the final checks, make sure everything's all good. So Rob's on the case now. Make it look all lovely. Oh, look at their moves. Ready for the customer. guys that brings us to the end of another one of our videos here at Black Stag Styling. Thank you for being with us to check out the work and styling we've been doing to this VW uh, Transporter T6 um, for some customers uh, that came to us to help well for us to help them with the styling um, and the ideas that Will had got uh, just to make sure we got it all exactly as he wanted on the van. So um, it's been a pleasure having this in. Let's start with the front of the vehicle. So start with the front, we've had front bumper all off, we've changed the grills, uh, top and bottom, so they were the grills with the, the textured grey with the chrome sections in, so they've all gone now. We've got the gloss black uh, grills, top and bottom in, we've got the addition 
uh, to the lower uh, front bumper, so the sport line sort of uh, section of the bumper added on, that's all been painted in body colour and fitted, of course with the black grills as well. Um, we have also taken the front badge, the VW badge or emblem that was chrome, that's now been done in the orange. Um, so the whole front of the vehicle really looking so much smarter now, everything of course all polished back on attached, bonded, whatever it needed to be done, all back onto the vehicle. So that's all sorted for the front. Moving down the sides of the vehicle, we have the new alloy wheels, uh, BBS alloys in like a sparkle black, really lovely and an 18 inch wheel. So just going up a couple of inches from the standard 16s. We've also got spacers. So the spacers just bring the wheels out now nicely to sit with the side of the van. So don't stick out just just fill the arches that little bit more and of course most importantly the orange brake calipers so they've been fully prepped done in an orange heat resistant paint of course matching in nicely with the badges just adding a bit of extra color really to the vehicle uh, moving to the back of the van we have our roof spoilers so they've been test fitted uh, primer painted and lacquered in body colour and then of course bonded onto the tops of the doors uh, and then we've got the VW badge which we've uh, taken off and we've done in the orange of course to match the calipers uh, and then of course everything fitted back on. We, we have removed the uh, couple of chrome badges around the back as well and just polished all the areas up um, just to add that finishing touch to the vehicle. So everything's now all done, it's all been washed, now ready to go back to Will. Uh, so a big thanks to Will for trusting us to do the uh, to, you, to do your pride and joy um, and I'm sure or I hope you're uh, I'm happy with it when you get here to collect it so uh, uh, as always guys don't forget please do like and subscribe to the channel turn on the old notifications stay fully up to date with everything we are doing we can give you a last look around the van as always to finish um, and then hopefully you'll check us out for some more videos in the uh, not too distant future so stay safe last look around the van and we'll catch you again soon take care